Hello and welcome to Brain Chow. Last week we started a new series where we compare one state against the rest of India. The intention behind this is highlighting the good in every state. Today we will be comparing Maharashtra against the rest of India. Number 1 Literacy The last census was in 2011. So the official literacy data is 7 years old. Instead of using outdated information, we are going to use estimated literacy rates of 2018. India's literacy rate is expected to be between 80 and 81% right now. Meanwhile, Maharashtra is ahead of national average with an estimated literacy of 87%. Number 2, infant mortality. Infant mortality rate is number of children who die before age of 1 year per 1000 children. India has infant mortality rate of 34 children per 1000. Whereas Maharashtra has much better infant mortality rate of 19 children per 1000. Number 3 per capita income. An average person in Maharashtra earns 147000 rupees per year this is substantially higher than the national average of 111000 rupees this is one of the reason why maharashtra is able to attract so many migrants from other states number 4 reach of electricity 92.5% households in Maharashtra have electricity connections which is again higher than the national average of 88.2%. Number 5 sanitation Urban Maharashtra has already been declared as open defecation free according to union report on sanitation 84% of Maharashtra is open defecation free compared to national average of 65%. Although the state is ahead of India, Maharashtra too has a tough task ahead to completely eradicate this practice. If you are still not impressed by Maharashtra, then let me tell you some more facts to showcase just how important this state is. Maharashtra is home to 9.28% of Indian population. It produces almost one third of the total movies made in India. It has the largest proportion of taxpayers among the states. It has almost 14% share of India's GDP, which is the highest. It also has the maximum number of UNESCO recognized World Heritage Sites in India. Four exclusive sites and one shared. It is also the largest producer of onions. I just mentioned that because I personally like onions. But anyways, I hope we have been able to highlight the importance of Maharashtra and how it performs against rest of India. That's it for this video. But next week we will be back with another state. Subscribe so that you don't miss out our future videos. Thanks for watching Brain Chow.